hated the time change this morning, but now that the day's over, I love the time change. It's Bling. Good morning, everybody. It is March 10th, Sunday. It is 5.39 in the morning, and they just changed the time. So because they changed the time, it looks like no other dashers are out there, so it's very busy. So might as well get started. Let's hit that button. My acceptance rate is 13%. I'm sure that's a record for, for me or not. Let's get the Uber going. All right. Now let's wait and see what we get. Five fifty for one point four miles. Except all right, we are on our way. Cameron, picking up a Cameron. Yeah, hi, uh, picking up for Tyler. Hi, the window. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. Thank you, too. Off that jack in the box delivery I think it was five dollars now I'm headed back to where all the restaurants are and waiting for the next offer oh wow that last looks like that last offer oh no it was five dollars <laughs> I did a 7-eleven before that I thought they upped the amount of money but they didn't okay I'm pulling up getting closer to the bonds I had to uh, skip the Starbucks one because this one's $20 for five miles so it's a much better offer I do have to shop for 20 items though so but whatever it should be done in, within an hour I'm pulling up, getting closer to the bonds. I had to uh, skip the Starbucks one because this one's $20 for five miles. So it's a much better offer. I do have to shop for 20 items though, so uh, 
whatever, should be done in, within an hour. Bye, Vons. Farewell, Vons. Goodbye, goodbye. Off to the drop off. Next delivery, McDonald's, 1.5 miles for $4.50, on our way. Guess it's slowed down now or all the actual people that decided to start their shift at 7 have now come online since the time change they're used to starting at 6 they decided oh I'm just gonna start at 7 because I don't want to change my sleep pattern or routine so most of them are probably gonna be working 7 to whatever like an hour later so maybe that's why it's slow now I'm not getting a darn thing. All right, I got a $4 offer for 2.9 miles or 2.7 or something like that. Turn right. Turn right. Here I come, Starbucks. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Have a good day. Another successful delivery. Last delivery was at 720 and it's now 742. It has been 22 minutes since my last delivery. It is slow. Now, well, I guess it'll just pick up when it picks up. All right, I got an offer. $5.50 for 4.3 miles, coffee, bean, and tea leaf. Accepting. All right. I am on my way. So 
seven miles. Now we're off to a $10 order at Sprouts and I believe it is a little over five miles for shopping for 10 items. Two Robertos, our second Robertos, it was five dollars and eighty cents for two more miles. So that's about twelve dollars for this one. Turn the last left. Roberto's order was delivered. Boy, that soda was big. 
delivered to a second floor apartment. And now I'm headed off to Sprouts, uh, $16 for, I think it was five miles. Turn left. Turn left. Maybe six and 20 items. It's gonna take an hour. It might take an hour to complete. I don't know. You never know. grocery order $16 and some change it's 7.2 miles to get to the drop-off so I think the total miles were <clears throat> total miles were 11 it was 11 miles for $16 not great but I'm almost done I'm almost already at my hundred dollar goal and it's only 945 so I should be done with the day by about uh, 1030 I think at the latest which is awesome One item, one unit, shop and pay five dollars, two and a half hours. Okay, might as well head to your pickup at Albertsons 2910 by Centennial Parkway. And then my day will be over. That's okay. I delivered the last one it was five dollars and it was, I think it was only two and a half miles so it was not too bad and so grand total I want to say 103 dollars I drove well, I gotta get home still so about 60 miles so pretty good that's all for today thanks for watching like and subscribe